before this video starts, guys, I want to say thank you for 100 subscribers. Um, it means a lot. Thank you guys so much. And yeah, I'm sure you guys want to watch the video, so let's get into it. Hey guys, it's Lost Dream Productions here, and today I'm going to be doing my Bad Batch set ideas um, for episodes 1 to 6. And I know they came out about a month ago, but uh, I had the idea to do it now, so I'm going to do it. And also, if you haven't checked out my giveaway video, I'm giving away a LEGO Star Wars Duel on Mustafar set for free. So if you want to go do that, um, all you got to do is subscribe and like my videos and stuff. But go watch that video if you want more information. Um, and yeah, that's still going on. So do that if you haven't already. And yeah, uh, let's get into the video. So the first set I have is an AAT. Um, and this is going to be cost 40... Uh, 40 USD and 50 Canadians would come with Commander Grey, who is in the first episode of the uh, Bad Batch, and uh, uh, his Jedi Master uh, Balaba, um, Jedi Master Balaba, and she's the one who uh, he kills in the first episode of Bad Batch. And it would come with a battle droid, a regular battle droid, and a battle droid pilot as well. Um, and the next set I have here is the set 30 USD, 40 Canadian V-Wing. I think this would come with a V-Wing pilot, obviously. We haven't gotten one for uh, seven years now, since 2014. And we, it would come with a Grand Moff Tarkin as well. Um, it's, it would be really nice to get a Grand Moff Tarkin um, in a cheaper set, because the last set I think we got him in is the Death Star. And that is a very expensive set, so it'd be nice to get uh, our hands on him easily. And the next set would be 60 USD and 80 Canadian. This is uh, uh, the like uh, clone farmer. The, his name is blanking on me, but the clone farmer's uh, house um, uh, cut. And this would be sort of like a building, just sort of like Hagrid's hut from Harry Potter. And it would come with four minifigs, um, that being cut himself, obviously, um, Omega, and... Uh, I was thinking Hunter and his uh, Cut's wife, um, who is a tw Twi'lek, I think. Um, so, yeah. Uh, that would be a pretty good set to get. Um, don't think we're actually going to get it, though. Um, but, yeah. So, let's get on to the next one. And the next set would be a Camino uh, set th costing 30 USD and 40 Canadian. This would come with two Kaminoans. This would be the first set we get Kaminoans in. Um, it would also come with two... Or one or two um, uh, uh, regular Phase 2 clones in the new 2020 style. And then I think Omega would also be another good figure to have in this set. I think she's going to be one of those figures that goes in a bunch of sets. The next set I think would be a Chase set. Um, and this is from Episode 4 three or uh i believe from the bad batch and it comes it's going to come with fennec two bark speeders the one we got in the bad batch the lime green one for hunter uh, who would also be in the set and fennec would have a whatever speeder she was on which i forget which one it was but yeah this set would cost 20 usd and 25 canadian and come with two uh figures um and the set the next set um it would be the set of an, a set from based off of uh, episode four of the Bad Batch, which would be um, the Rancor uh, Moochie, uh, Moochie's Rescue, and it would come with, and this set would come with Moochie the Rancor as a uh, younger Rancor and uh, Wrecker, and this uh, uh, this uh, whatever they're called Slavers, uh, the one of those figures. And it would be the first time we'd get one of these, and we saw them in the Clone Wars as well, so good time to finally get it, and we can maybe get one of their new yellow whip pieces, like maybe a new mold. So yeah, let's get on to the next set. Um, the next set, I think, would be a uh, Rafa and Trace Martez's uh, um, ship, um, based off the Bad Batch, maybe the Clone Wars, but uh, it, for this is the Bad Batch set idea, so Bad Batch. It would come with Rafa and Trace Martez, obviously, in their uniform, uh, like that. Um, from the episode R7, which is Ahsoka's droid, and I think this uh, set would be really similar to the ITS transport from last year, with like two figures and a droid or two, you know, that sort of thing, where the figures aren't very good, and it's like, no one really wants the set. But just think of it as that kind of a set, where it's like a 140 Canadian, 100 can uh, USD set, where two figures, and like the s figures are, you know, they're decent, but they're not that good. So yeah, that's pretty much all for this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed, and tell me which one you think are going to be uh, realistic in this, because personally, I don't think any of them are really going to happen. I wish, um, but yeah, I don't think, because Lego, I don't really think will cover the Bad Batch that much. Um, 
But yeah, so stay tuned for my other uh, one or two episodes for Bad Batch Set Ideas. And yeah, that's all for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed, and see you on the next one. Bye.